I found something of Brian's. Old photos you have to see. Let me show you. Look, look, look at that. Are you kidding me? Look at that. Oh my gosh. Look at this stud. Well, he looks like a dork there. But look at this stud. Are you kidding me? Brian, oh, turn the water off. Explain yourself. Oh, hi. <laughs> yes, oh, hi, Daddy. Oh my gosh, what's your secret? Yeah, my secret is about 30 years younger. That's, <laughs> that's the secret of that. Whew. Those were the days. I was teaching probably seven, eight aerobic classes a week. So you were a day. You were full blown Jane Fonda in those I pictures. I was, I was. Gloria Stevens. And I wonder if anyone out there remembers those. Push and down for Tad. Push. Well, we got to find the, like the tights that you were wearing and bring those back. <laughs> I want to see if they still fit you. The unitard. Or see if they fit me. Anyway, welcome to the vlog, you guys. We have a fun one planned right now. We are headed to the gym, ironically, to get some, some abs. I'm gonna yeah, see. see if I can find them again. <laughs> I'm Where gonna use they go. I'm gonna use that picture as motivation today. Yeah, yeah I need that too. <laughs> Thirty years later. <laughs> and you've aged like a fine, fine wine. Yeah, age being the, the operative word. Oh my gosh. So tell me about these photos, seriously. So I had these pictures taken, probably, I don't know, I would say I was anywhere, I don't know, 28 to 32 years old, because I was living in Boston. So that's kind of when I, when I moved to Boston. And they were kind of press photos because I was doing you know, class master classes in aerobics and stuff. So you'd want to send these out to get people to you come. You were doing a master class. Master class, yeah. Like you would teach. Hey, master. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, but the thing was, people were like, oh, like the, your abs are unbelievable. It was kind of my job. Yeah. I, I mean, I was working in the clubs, the athletic clubs. Oh. So I was constantly teaching. I was constantly working out, you know, and I was young, so it really didn't matter what I ate. I was never a big drinker, so it didn't really, you know, affect me that way, but I could eat anything I wanted. And I look now and I'm like, okay, I feel bigger, I feel more muscular than I did. Of course, you know, I don't have the washboard anymore. I have, I have the you know, you got a little extra love handle. I, I got that because and I need those handles. No, it's just be it's what happens when you get older. I mean, I'm sorry. We still eat pretty well. Yeah, we we don't drink Moderation. anymore or any less. Moderation. You know, yeah. so well, it, it, it's it's just part of life. I mean, it's 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 getting older and you I kind of have to accept that it's not easy to accept. And I'm sure there's a lot of guys out there my age that are thinking the same thing. Like well, yeah, it, actually, I think our viewers would like to hear this. Like, <clears throat> how have people looked at you differently? So take this body. How did men talk to you versus when you were a bit older and maybe didn't have this body? I can tell you because I used to bartend at the gay clubs and I did look like this. Yeah. And I can honestly say I was never hit on. Really? And I would be shirtless a lot of the times. Sometimes, yeah, they were just sometimes. Look at the hair, the fuzz. Sometimes I, I would. <laughs> sometimes I would just be in my underwear bartending. Really? In boxer briefs, because Calvin this, Klein's. This Calvin one. Klein's. Yeah, 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 yeah. Calvin Klein's. See that bottom one there? That the are those Calvin Klein white yes, boxer briefs? Yes, yes. But then, of course, we had our press photos. This was with my partner Don, which was yeah. hilarious because we had. I actually had a cable television show. I can't see you being an aerobics instructor. But look, shaved. 
shaved and looked matching, yeah, no. matching unitards. I'm a hair guy. I like hair. I and like then that what do you say about this more. one? You're a big dork in that picture. <laughs> yeah. No, Like I used to cute. teach it that. You're cute. Used to teach it that. And oh, another press phone. What I'm loving is, is my hair. You know, my, yeah. I, it's like, where did that go? Yeah. And I, I mean, obviously I could get it back in a second you with a bottle. You are such a, I, I, you I are still, such a handsome photogenic man. And I've, I have somebody who hasn't always been proud of who they love. Aww. These make me so proud and you make me proud. Like it's not just seeing you in, in sexy washboard six packs. It's just, I don't know, you, you just, See, never cease to amaze me. Oh, that's so, that's Seriously, so sweet. Like, I know that's weird and like whatever, but. And when we found these, I was like, oh my gosh. It's like, and, and then of course, we always kind of, you know, knock ourselves down. We're the hardest judge. We're the hardest ones on ourselves. And I'm like, oh God, like how can he even look at me? Like, look at me like that. But I'm like, well, he's. Yes, he's attracted to that, but I think he's attracted to that because it was me. I'll tell you, if <laughs> if I saw this serving me a drink at a bar, I would definitely give you a little flirt. Where's the one with the smoldering look? I'd give you the smoldering look. There it is. That's the look I'd give you. Let me see. I'm like, oh, you're talking to me? But, of course, it was, what was it, the 80s, 90s, early 90s? Power suit. Power tie, yes, there are shoulder pads in that. But it is, it's, it is a total lifestyle because, you know, people still ask me, it's like, well, how do you stay in shape? We just, I, we live a healthier lifestyle. That's the thing, Brian. Like when you, when you have a foundation that is this going through your entire life, you have the, the motivation to go to the gym, to eat right, to do the things, like this is this is the result. I mean, but it, I know you have your orthopedic injuries. Yeah, you yeah, had yeah. shoulder, knee surgery, Achilles, all these things, which I think actually if you were didn't have all those things, you might still have Right. You, you actually asked me that the other day, and I'm like, yep, because I'd be running every day. So that's why it's important. Oh, no. You so. just take care of your body. You, you stay healthy. You do the right things. And you, everyone knows the right things to do. And it's and it's and not like you can't. You just do it. I'm sorry. You can start it when you're 65. Totally. You can start it when you're 70. I yeah. remember my mom started swimming yeah. when she was like 65 yeah. and just loved doing it. And... You know, you can still build muscle mass. You can still get in shape. It doesn't matter well, what age. And I want to be careful with this conversation because this is not the ideal male form, right? Like, oh, gosh, there's no. all sorts of ways that men are supposed to and should look. I think we put a lot of stress on each other. Of course we as, do. As men, as gay men. Gay men. look a certain way. You, you, you want to look like a bear, but not too bearish. You want to look like a silver daddy, but not too old. If there's too many wrinkles, then you're yeah. too old. Like, exactly. like, we have these like slots in our community and it freaking sucks. Yeah. Well, Brian, after looking at these spicy photos, <laughs> I think I need some uh, some time in the bedroom. You know what oh, I mean? Oh, mm -hmm. I, I, do you want me to join you? Fired up. Yeah, you can join me. There you go. We're going to go well, do some crunches. We're going to do some crunches first, and then, and then, then we can do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys. Thanks again for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. We have a membership. Join the membership and yeah. check out some of the links. In the Email us if you want. Outloudjb at gmail.com. Outloudjb at gmail.com. And as always, don't forget to live your lives out loud. Bye. So Brian, the real question is, can you maintain a six pack with all that bacon? Yes. You can? Everything's in moderation. Mm. Except for you. <laughs> I need as much of you as I can get.